what's up guys it's boy zach here and today's video is going to be my setup tour for 2016 i've been waiting for a new setup for a while now i had to wait for a couple of parts to come through i've got a new pc and everything i'm so happy about this setup so i'm just going to show you everything from my pc to my console to my monitors and screens um to my microphone and my also my programs on the pc um, that I use to um, record and make my videos. So let's get into it. So first up here we have my chair. It's actually a GT Omega. Uh, it's not a leather chair because um, they didn't have a dominantly red chair um, in leather material. So I decided to take this one. I'm very happy about it right now. Uh, I recommend you to take these seats. They are really comfortable and good for your back. Uh, I decided to take GT Omega because it was a bit cheaper than the X Racer, but I've heard a lot of good things about um, the DX Racers as well. And then first off to get um, started, we're going to talk about the monitors and screens. So here we have a um, Samsung TV that I am going to use to play um, chill games like um, FIFA, uh, GTA and Rocket League. All those games will be on that big screen for my PS4. Oh, I actually got this screen like three years ago for my birthday or something like that and I do not know at all which model it is so don't even ask me. Then here we have uh, an Asus monitor for my um, um, computer. My computer is actually uh, behind over here and I'll show you it later. And I think it's like 23 inches, it's like 5 milli, milli what the fuck, milli watt per second. Uh, I don't know what, it's like five, um, what's it, the response time, I forgot, you know, one, five M per, per S, I don't remember what it's called, oh, that's actually retarded from me, then we have uh, the tryhard monitor, basically, it's a BenQ RL2455HM, it's basically the best, the best they had um, when I ordered mine, uh, it's got a one, millisecond response time i think is that um then and that's basically gonna be for cod so that's like um try hard basically yeah that's what i'm gonna do with that so i've got the three screens but i'm basically gonna use this one and this one the most um and from time to time i actually might use this as a second monitor for my um pc if i'm playing uh csgo or something and I want to do something else on another screen so that would be a practical for me then as you can see uh, my headset is an Astro A40 it's uh, the first gen I believe I've got some uh, optic uh, Astro tags uh, I had it was so complicated to get those I had to get them de delivered in America and then um, I had to get someone I knew in America to send them to me so that was a bit complicated then if you follow the wire here, I've actually got a um, flashlight to show you this because it's so deep, uh, dark under here. You've got my mix amp over here um, and that also links actually um, my um, PC via this cable. You can't see actually if I show you via that cable to the left here. And then you've got the setup buttons and everything. I don't really know about uh, the two on top of the game and voice thing. And then my PS4 underneath here, of course. Then I've got a scuff cable to my um, scuff here. It's the... I've already made a video about this. It's one of my most watched videos on my channel, actually. Um, it's the Scump um, PS4 uh, King Scuff. Uh, I'll put the link in the description if you want to buy one. Then... Of course, so I've showed you the PS4, I've showed you the mix amp, I've showed you the monitors and screens, the scuff. So then we've got the mic. The mic is actually a uh, blue snowball mic with uh, the tripod. It came with it. Uh, you just It's just a uh, USB um, cable. You just pop it in the back and then into your computer. So that's really easy to use. And then uh, I've got a steel series mouse mat i think it's the quick i don't remember what size it is but they've got a load of different sizes i went with like kind of smaller one 
Then uh, the com the mouse here. I think it's a, a Steel Series Kunzu Plus or something like that. That uh, my cousin Oliver just uh, bought for me. Actually, I'll put his link in the description as well. I've already made some videos and talked about him. Um, so um, I'll put his link in the description. Then, of course, we've got the keyboard. It's the Razer Black Widow Chroma, and I've got it on the wave setting because I think it's the best. But I'm going to show you actually if we hop onto Razer Synapse here, you can go onto this lighting, and then you can choose all the different effects here. So we've got breathing. You can set up two colors so it breathes in, breathes out, and then. There it breathes in, now it breathes out, now it breathes in, another colour. You can put one or two colours as you wish. Then you can do it so it reacts to the the what the what the keys you are pressing. Or you can do uh the colour cycle, that's the basic one. It just does it on its own, cycles through the colours of the chroma. Then You've got static, just one colour at the time, stays like that the whole time, it really looks good. And then you've got the chroma wave here, I think that's the best one. And then you've got, I don't know how this is called in English, but basically it's kind of like uh, the mix between reactive and the chroma wave, except that when you touch a key, it starts away from where you touched, and it's just one colour, so that looks really good as well. But I prefer the Chroma Wave. I think it just looks really, really good. Um, then, um, what shall I show you now? I'm going to show you my PC. So my PC is actually behind the monitor here. So I'm going to have to use the flashlight again. It's um, MSI uh, Nightblade thing. Uh, I don't know. I've got Intel i7 in it. Um, and the NVIDIA GeForce GTX. 970 or something like that. So on the front you've got um, uh, the CD thingamabob Then here on this side you've got some jacks and a USB and the power is here Here I'm not going to press that and then at the back you have all the cables and the USB So that's really the wire management isn't as good as it could be right now, but um, I'm just happy to have my setup so I'm not really bothered with it. So boom that's it for the computer I'll leave a link in the description for everything as I said because uh, I don't know much about computers and stuff like that. Uh, so to end off the video I'm just going to show you um, some things that I have on my PC for YouTube. So I've got Vegas here. Yeah, As you can see uh, I did crack it. It's easy you just go on YouTube and there will be a load of tutorials because I'm not ready to pay like $400 for that. Then. I've got Photoshop, um, same thing for that, I have to crack it, then to record my uh, voice, I used the mic and then Audacity because it is really simple and easy to use and it has a good quality as well with the default setting, then of course we've got Steam here to place um, games, um, there's the programming app for the Chroma keyboard. Then we've got um, to actually stream when I will. I've already installed OBS, but I have to like figure it out because I don't really, really know yet. But um, we'll see about that. I'll stream uh, actually soon, at least try. Uh, it will probably be um, CSGO, uh, FIFA or COD, or even Rocket League with some of my friends. But I don't really know yet. And then... Um, what's left? There's this. I actually installed something else. I can't find right now. Xbox Gamecast. So I think it aim of the PC or did it not? I don't remember actually. There was this thing. Or Nvidia Shadow Play. Which one is it? I don't know basically. But OBS can also record your PC screen and yeah. That's basically it for my setup. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll leave everything in the link down below. And I've actually got another friend that wants to start making videos. And he hasn't got like the confidence yet. But I'll try getting his channel name. Um, and if I do get it, 
I'll put it down in the description and I'll put his Twitter as well so go like har harass him and tell him to make videos because he's annoying me it's been like a month that he was supposed to upload his first video but he hasn't yet and I'm like pissed about it so go and tell him he's nice and shit like that but I hope you did enjoy the video if you did don't forget to leave a like um kind of feedback on what can I do to make these videos better I, I know I didn't speak very very well in this video but it's been a long time speaking to a camera can be difficult and kind of stressful even when you've done 100 videos on your channel um but I hope it, it didn't like stop you from enjoying the video and subscribe for more content I'll be uploading more FIFA and COD and other games like I don't know I might try and make some CSGO um, supply drop openings. No, they're not called supply drops, are they? They're called um, cases. Might do that. I'm going to try and stream soon. So go um, follow my Twitch channel. It's uh, twitch.tv slash I'm Zax. Um, you can also follow me on Twitter. I'll put it down in the description. And, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe for more. This was Boy Zax. I'll see you next time. Peace.